I'm making pretty good progress in this. Uh, Alright, let me have a look at something. I think the way I should approach it now is kind of take the ones that I haven't unlocked yet and play as them. I haven't even read, uh... Better items, no mantle? Jeez. Ugh. That's like how he used to be when he first came out. Better shops, greed is good. More options, less rooms. That sounds alright. Shadow Eater, whatever that means. Okay, so... I haven't unlocked Kane or Maggie, so let's try Kane. We need to do the alternate path and the beast on this anyway, so... I think that's the way I'm gonna play it, is like... Just go around and try and unlock all of them. With the exception of the twins, cause... no. Uh, I'm not joking, I'm not touching that character until it is absolutely necessary. Uh-uh. I don't even want to think about how I'm gonna complete some of the things with that character. This game is so wild, you've only played it a handful of times, but there's so much- Oh, yeah, this latest uh, DLC adds so much. But I think it's now in a position where that's it. They're not gonna do much else to it. This is one of my favorites, it's... It's gotten uh, a lot of playtime over the years, between multiple systems. It is wild to think that, uh, when the dude made it, it was just like a very spur of the moment thing, and he didn't think it was gonna do well, and he almost sold the rights. I think it was to Cartoon Network. And they were gonna readapt the game, but then someone convinced them not to. And then it went viral, so... I remember, I can't remember if it was in the indie game documentary or something along those lines, but it was discussed, like, the origins of this game. Go skeletons, go! Oh, they they do not mess around. Alright, I got another one to join the army. Uh yeah, no bomb unfortunately. Okay. It's definitely worth getting into this one. Before I started streaming, I used to play it on, uh, my laptop on the way to work. On the train. It was perfect because it took about an hour to get into the city. At, at that point in time. And a run... ...would last about an hour back then, so... I'd try to... ...get something done. And yeah, perfect time. I should just hang back, honestly. <laughs> it's 
it's a necromancer build. It's pretty fun. Yes! <laughs> Four skeletons now. Uh, the thing is, as good as this is, I don't think it's good enough to do the alternate path, but I guess I have to try. Then again, what's the other thing I have to do? Hush. Hmm. I, I guess? Maybe I should just go for the character unlock. Oh no, one of my skeletons died, no. Okay, boss time. No, keep him alive. <laughs> they are my source of damage right now. So dark, what, the game or the, uh, the curse? Or both? Uh, oh, come on again! <laughs> I was about to say, there we go, that's normal now. No, it's not. Yeah, this is one of these things where I kind of wish I had a worse monitor. Because on good monitors, black is really, really dark. On uh, cheaper monitors, black is more of a grey. So it's easier to see. I used to have this monitor that had a dedicated button that you would press that would, uh... Is it lower the gamma or increase the gamma? Anyway, it would adjust it so then black wasn't so dark and it was more washed out. And I would press that button every time Curse of Darkness would come up in Isaac. <laughs> I'm more used to it now, but back then I was like, man, this curse is annoying, I'm just gonna press my button. So, yeah. I do miss that monitor. It had a bunch of weird features that uh, were great. That's clever. You want you want to hear clever? Once my uh, headset broke. And I was too poor, because I was a student at the time, to get a new one for a while. So, again, this magical monitor that had so many good features, um, it had a built-in webcam and a microphone. And so what I did, I put the monitor on the floor next to me, on sort of like a little cardboard box, and I plugged in the power cable, and then I took the, the, uh... Because the way the webcam connected was with this USB cable. So I ran that USB cable into my other computer. And I was using a 22-inch monitor as my microphone for about five, six months. 
And no one could tell that, that that was the case, but I had to take a photo. People didn't believe me. I wish I still had it, but I, I don't know where the photo is. It's somewhere on an old drive. <laughs> that's hilarious. But you, you do what you gotta do, right? Like, that's... You make do with what you have. My options were either do that, which the microphone was very decent, or go to, uh... I mean, I don't know what the equivalent is, but we have this store in Australia called The Reject Shop. Um... And they just sell stuff pretty cheap. It's like, most stuff is... It's rare to see anything over ten dollars in that store. So that was the alternative, go there and buy a microphone from that, which would have sounded horrendous. Anyway, that, that's that's my dodgy stuff. <laughs> Anyone else got any stories of, like, jank that they've had to do just to, uh... Not really make ends meet, but more just, you do what you do to survive. Guess your equivalent would leave five below, which is similar. Yeah, because... Five US dollars... I mean, it equates to like about 750 Australian, but add in the Australia tax, and then it's about 10 bucks. Mm. It was pretty much just always stuff from uh, China or like Southeast Asia, off brand stuff, like legally distinct. The budget Halloween costumes from those places were always fantastic. Like, Italian plumber costume. And of course, they can't say Super Mario, but we all know who it is. Or like, a uh, Scary Dragon costume, which was Bowser. Buzz Lightyear was a uh, space hero. Uh, let's see what's in here. You never know. Laser. That's not really gonna help, I don't think. I'll do it. Oh, wait, this is different. They've changed how this works now. Weird. Anyway. My character looks like a psychopath. Yeah. Because I got, uh... Chaos. Okay, now, now it looks like a Bond villain. I'm just missing the cat. One thing I will say about those stores, um... The most expensive items they would sell would be DVD players at the time. And they were about, what, like 50 to 70 dollars? And... Those DVD players were better than the... Like most of the super expensive ones. Because those were built to play basically any format, like, even... ...pirated DVDs, which the other players would have, a ...an issue playing. I mean, this just kind of outs how old I am, right? But, like... <laughs> ...DVD players didn't play everything right away. 
you were pretty much stuck with uh, retail copies. You couldn't play DVDs that were uh, made by a less legal man as, let's just say, oh, how about this? Home homemade DVDs. There you go. That's the legal way to say that. But these $50, $60 DVD players, fucking mental, would play everything under the sun. Formats you'd never even heard of. Okay, so, uh, it, whilst it's not a pet cat, it's a pet leech, so, there you go, there's, there's the full, uh, outfit. Gotta pay extra for that DRM. I don't know what it was, but... They could also play, uh... Just files straight off the drive, which, yeah, a lot of them couldn't do. I think the wildest purchase I made at one of those stores, it was a, uh... A CD player. Like, a uh, Portable one. One of those small ones, right? Like a Walkman or a Discman, whatever the fuck Sony used to call them. It was $30, and... It looked really tacky. It was blue, plastic. It looked like a Fisher-Price toy. However, in big letters on it, it, it had, like, Supreme Anti-Skip Protection. So that was the big rage, was like... Before, uh, iPods and all that were out. CD players would have this thing where, oh, if you, are, uh, If you're doing exercise, uh, we have anti-skip protection. So then your disc won't jump, right? And you can do your exercise whilst, uh, wearing a CD player. And it was, it was a cool feature. Um, it would work to some extent. This thing, I'm not exaggerating, like, I would hold it and shake it as hard as I could, and the thing wouldn't fucking skip. Whilst uh, a friend of mine had, like, a really expensive Sony one, and he would do the same thing, and it could hold up for maybe three seconds, and then it would inevitably jump, because, of course, you're doing it at full force. Me, you would hear, like, the parts kind of making a weird sound, but the thing wouldn't skip. And even amazingly so, is you would open it, and the disc would stop spinning, but it would play- keep playing music for like, I don't know, a good three seconds after you open the lid. Thirty dollars, like... You would not expect that. But between the DVD players and those, uh, CD players, made me change my perspective on, uh, branded stuff at a young age. Just because it has a brand doesn't necessarily mean it's great. I was- I was really happy with that purchase. Oh, come on. <laughs> How much have I donated? Come on. Dude. Oh, I, I am pushing it here. It's okay, I, I have a sun card, I can fully heal. Ah, uh, okay. Uh, yeah, I'm not sure that was entirely worth it, but I guess we'll see. I'll save the card for now, because I don't think I need it. That was a lot. Yeah, I mean, ideally you want him to cough up the item pretty early, but...
I've had really unlucky runs where uh, I've had to practically throw a hundred coins into it. The only reason I was so adamant was because chaos is something I have where it could be any item. Usually it's just health. Uh, will that give me a... Yeah, dead cool. Bone friend. I'm just thinking, do I want to go back to the... Nah, let's just keep going. Oh. Oh, it's already over. Um, okay, so I do have a trinket with me, so I can unlock the character if I want. Is that what it's called? No. <laughs> I'm just, that's what I'm calling them. Hey, I should let the leech do some work here to heal me back up. Yeah, okay, this is... Bone friend, bone pal. Bone thugs and friendship. I don't know. What do you want me to call it? There we go. Oh no, he died. I summoned... <laughs> I summoned him on spikes. Okay, one of them survived at least. You love the little noise the leech makes. That's one thing that uh, the creator of this game is very good at. It's just... The mix between kind of disgusting, but yeah, it can be adorable. The key is just put a little derpy face on it, and it could be very disgusting, like uh, poop, but then it's also adorable. Make it make like a little sound. There are certain tricks to, like, ensuring that your game is well received. A very simple one is just putting an adorable face on an otherwise threatening and disgusting enemy. Another one is... If there's a doggo, it must be pet. Like, you, it's, it's a... It's a test right there of good game developer or not is... Do they have a dog in game? If so, are they allowing you to pet it? <laughs> Too many bad game devs. Yeah, don't allow the doggo to be pet. I've been disappointed many a time. You know what I learned? Um, because I finished Cult of the Lamb recently. If you have a dog follower, you there is a specific interaction that lets you pet a dog follower. So, they have thought of it. I'm not sure which one is the dog follower, but it, it's a thing. Mm. 
Ah, oh, that's rude. I can't remember if this gives me... No. This is the one that when I get to low health, it'll throw me a heart as like a last resort, which I, I guess is fine. No, skeleton friend. <laughs> okay. Now I am an ominous skull. An ascended Bond villain. Who has 420 in terms of damage, okay. As visually interesting as this is, it's kind of mediocre in terms of how much it does in damage. Oh, I see it's in the corner. Um, I gotta look for the Tinted Skull. <laughs> I should have been paying more attention sooner. Ah. Ooh. I wonder if this works with lasers. Let's see. Yep, it works. This could be interesting. I do like that they've, uh, made things work with one another a bit better. Skeletons! Okay. I need to find the skull. Where is it? Um, first of all, let me dump this here so I don't lose it. Hey, Nick, how's it going, dude? How's things? Oh, see, I'm now I'm not a Bond villain. I kind of miss the old look. Uh, it's not here. I mean, I may as well see if I can get something for free. Hold it. 
Mm, nah, okay. We're looking for a skull with a little uh, cross on it. On the top left corner of the skull. There it is. Okay. Pretty good. It's the weekend, right? Yeah. Time to kick back. Got anything going on? Oh, yeah, right. It's two fights. Another friend. Don't stomp them. Don't kill my skeleton friends. Ah. Not really just chilling. Oh, I mean, there's nothing wrong with just chilling. I think that's uh, something that's often overlooked, is the value of doing nothing. Okay, I gotta leave this behind. There we go. Take the negative. That's unfortunate. Okay, we're ready. I was taking a sip of my beverage. Did I leave a trinket in the boss fight yet? Yeah. I just did it. <laughs> ooh, ooh, this is a tough choice. On the one hand, that's damage. On the other, the egghead can negate damage. I left it in the mom fight, yeah. I did. Look a shot, that's probably, ooh. See, I guess the thing is, this serves less of a purpose, I guess, ultimately. Whereas in this can prevent bad stuff from happening. I'm pretty sure it works, I don't know, we'll see. If it doesn't work, no biggie. I could always leave one here, can't I? Before I grab the note, because... It still works the same way, I'm pretty sure. 
I just need to find one. Things are so annoying. Uh, ooh, that's a tough choice. I guess if I'm gonna rely on magic happening when I take damage, let's just go all in on it. Did I hear Terraria 1.44 supposed to come out in late September? I did not, no. But, I mean, it was supposed to come out in July, so grain of salt. They said they are done with everything. Interesting. Again, same thing happened. <laughs> Alright, stapler. But that's cool if it comes out then. Okay, cool. Uh, I'm just thinking where the other room would be. Here? No, wait, that can't be right. Here. What does that trinket actually do? Does it heal when you use uh, an item? That would be my guess. I still haven't learnt what all the trinkets do. Activates the item before the damage would be taken. Oh, eh. Eh, I'm good. I can live without that. I'm not confident that I'm going to finish it. I don't really have high damage or interesting tiers, so... This is going to be a case of just try. I mean, if I get the character unlock, I'm more than happy. You get eight charges in the last boss fight. True, but... Yeah, see, it does work. See? Just 
keep pushing me like this. I'm leaving. Good. Leave. We'll be fine without you. And enough. And so. I don't really have that much health. <laughs> that's that's where the confidence is uh, lacking. Although if I had damage reduction, that would be a huge thing as well. But I can use the crack key. Yeah, but like, what am I gonna get out of it? Honestly, it's fine. I could take more damage. Okay, nice. That was huge. It might not necessarily be beneficial. Most likely it won't be. Nah, I'm good. Honestly, it's fine. Oh yeah, right, this is CR. Leech, go. You need to repent. You need to confess your sins and become saved. Let his light inside you cleanse your you soul. I'm casting huge doubt here. <laughs> it's okay. Character unlocked. That's what I was aiming for. How much health does that thing have? I know it has a lot. Oh, 
Oh, okay, you know what? That's fine. Gimpy hasn't been going off as much as I uh, would have liked. Ah, <laughs> oh, you dick. Of course I had to hit me. <laughs> I'm good. That's not a good trinket to get. I know, like, I'm being greedy here, but sometimes there is a, uh, what do you call it? Like, one of those, uh, fortune-telling machines. I'm just gonna quickly look and see if there isn't one. There are health- there's health everywhere, so... Okay, yeah, all right. I'm happy with that. That'll do. Wait, does that mean... No, okay. Okay. It's something. Nice. <laughs> okay. That's a pretty big deal. Okay, you are unlocked. Not so great, but okay. We go. Go, Leech, go. I fucking hate that brimstone attack. Yeah, so Gimpy's not helping. Wow. I only have three luck. No, but that shouldn't matter. Like, I've had one luck and it goes off way more often. I 
That's just unlucky. Like, I should have had at least one proc already. I'm not expecting it to go off every hit, but it should have gone off at least once. That's just a chance. No, I know, but... <laughs> I'm saying... Odds. Odds. It should have happened. I'm not saying it should have happened on every hit, but... One. If you look at how much damage I took on the climb, like... Yeah, that was... Just a bit unlucky. Okay, I got the character unlocked. That's that's it. Try and get a perfection trinket with this item. Oh, like the A plus thing? E yeah. I mean, you say try to get one as if, like, I can do something to stack odds in my favor. Yo, try to make random work in your favor. What I need you to do. I need you to bend the fabric of the universe and make the game give you this item. Just don't get hit for three bosses in a row. Oh, okay. Interesting. I mean, that's all well and good, but like eventually I will take damage. It's it's gonna help carry in the early game, but then when I get to whatever final boss I get to, it's odds are I will lose it. Uh, yeah, okay, keep going. That's kind of why Blue Crown, if it comes up later and I have a choice between it, sometimes I won't take it. It's on that basis, it's just... Yeah, I mean, it's great for clearing rooms, but in terms of boss, eh, it's not great. I guess for this run, I'm gonna go for Hush, unless I get damage reduction, which then I'll do one of the alternate paths. That's how I'm gonna play it. Go away. It's just more of a fact that uh, you lose it when you take one hit. It doesn't matter. 
if I'm close towards the end it's, and I have a better choice of something that's more sustained damage that I don't have to try to not take a hit on, then it's it's better. If you have a better option, there aren't really many be better options. Alright, let's say there was a minion. I would take the minion over the blue crown. Because the minion is more sustained damage. Let's say I, I get really fucking unlucky and take a hit in the first three seconds of the fight. The minion's going to do more damage overall. That is not a better option. It depends on the situation, like, your definition of better is, like, if you were to not take damage and the absolute perfect situation happened where you never ever took damage, then yeah, it's not better. But I look at it from the perspective of, hmm, am I going to be that unlucky where I take a hit immediately? Which can happen on these bullet hell bosses. If you do 20 damage, you do way more damage in the 3 seconds. I would argue no. A minion can surely do more than 60 damage in an overall, like, delirium fight, for example. Or, uh, I guess in the case of alternate path, like that mother fight, it's not unrealistic for me to not even get a hit in and take damage. The angelic minion does quite a bit of damage for a minion. Uh, yeah, I mean, I just don't believe that. I'm just going to keep going with this. Seraphim is the only good minion, but isn't that like the only minion you can get from Angel Rooms? Oh no, you can get, um, what do you call it? The Horseman, which is also a decent minion, it does damage. You still hate taking them, I don't, I don't care, I'm just saying that, like... The, my point stands, then, in, in, a, in the context of, let's say, I defeat Mom's Heart. And then I get the option of a blue crown and the minion. I'm gonna take the minion. Just in my belief that... If I get hit in the first couple of seconds on, of the fight, it fucking sucks. And it happens to me more often than not. Okay, there we go. One day I will get the magical kamikaze combo. Judgment. Interesting. Uh, I'm gonna leave it for now. I 
I could probably get something out of it. Uh, that's face, which I guess I can get. It's not bad. Oh, I should probably blow them up, actually. I just gotta be careful now when picking up items. Yeah, I mean, you just gotta be more reserved when you pick up items, that's pretty much it. I think it's good, because if I have an item that's, like, not that great, I can opt for more health, which will help if we're doing the, uh, the other fight, what do you call it, dogma. Having more health is a great thing. Damn it. Ah, oh, come on. I really don't like this fight. Just these balls are so obnoxious. Okay. Uh What? Really? You asshole. Um. Okay, here's the thing. Because I have. I have a way to heal. And there's quite a few hearts around. Probably worth the risk. Oh, right. There's, I have a whole ro room full of them. It's a bit of an awkward room, but I'll deal with it. I guess at this point I'd be going for, uh, ah. It depends, we'll see. Thank you. Trying my hardest not to collect the soul hearts. Okay. Just money. That's unfortunate. But I can still do the other part. Okay. I 
I still got all my soul hearts back, so that's good. Oh, you dick. I hate this room, it's so awkward. What's with the random troll bomb every now and then? It's gotta be the bag that's doing that. going. Oh, right, I can't go straight across. It's okay, I didn't lose it. I suppose I'll drop the... Well, not that it matters now. I don't need to do that anymore. Am I sure about that? I don't know. The answer is no, but I'm not really going to look into it. Unless there's something already in the room. Ah. Uh, okay. Oh, come on. Alright, I'm gonna... Since I am going for that path, I'm not gonna grab that. I have decent enough damage to get me through this. And I'll just grab it on the ascend. That's pretty much the meta. 
I would imagine is just try not to grab items and then hope for a planetarium. Uh, interesting. I see now I'm you now I'm using it. There's a chance that I could get slow time, and that would really work. <laughs> I was like, wait, where is it? Oh, it's slowed. Right. Cool. Not. Oh no, damn it. <laughs> I rushed into it. I should have picked synth up. Oh well. Yeah, I forgot. I mean, it's okay. Health is good too. I'm creating more padding for myself ultimately. I'm sure that's not going to cost me too much. Thank you. Yeah, it's definitely the fanny pack dropping troll bombs. I went for another health up instead of the fly. Because heal, and then maybe... How is this not- oh my god. Um, alright, here's- here's a neat little trick. Give me a, give me a heal. How have you not broken? Taking my time here, it doesn't matter. Blessing in disguise. Um, right? I didn't take the blood bag, but that's okay. It doesn't matter. Okay. Oh, 
Well, I mean, the autumn is definitely serving its purpose. Now I need to be careful in the planetarium. I need to be absolutely fucking certain that I'm picking up the item. Assuming it happens. Slowed, thankfully. I don't have uh, the use item. I mean, this is pretty good. I didn't have to do that, but... Alright, get this. I'm gonna go drop it in... here. Oh, whoops, wrong button. <laughs> Sorry. Drop it. I could do this, but I don't know how much health I have. Hello? <laughs> there we go. It's not what I was looking for, keep going. No planetarium. Ah, oh, I thought that would get him. Very fortunate. <laughs> hey, Virtual Hogging. Thanks so much for the three months, dude. Appreciate it a lot. Uh, run's going well. I'm trying to do the, uh, the base path for this character. Okay, keep it going.
trying the strategy of not grabbing items to try and force a uh, planetarium. Do I have alerts turned off? Uh, yeah. I kind of stopped doing them, to be honest. I have to turn off desktop audio there when I'm doing console because uh, otherwise the sound double up. Oh wait, that's not a problem anymore now that I got this mixer thingy. Yeah, I don't know. I guess I got kind of tired of text-to-speech stuff. You know what it's like? It's like... You know how RGB lighting can be seen as uh, tacky? Like, text-to-speech is the RGB lighting of the streaming world. <laughs> oh, that's- that's, uh, that's a pretty hot take, but that's, uh, my take. Oh, shit. This is interesting. Um, I still think- no, I should stick with, uh, this, right? Okay, I'm gonna leave this shop for now, because I want to keep the temp health, just to encourage, uh, still getting the angel room, but I'll probably just take both, uh, food items. Unless I get a really absurdly good trinket to absorb. No luck on the planetarium play though. It doesn't look like it's gonna happen. Which is fine, you know, it was a gamble. never a sure thing. Okay, where is the skull? Numb your brain so you don't have to think about the pain that Dead Cells has brought you. <laughs> Fair. I'm gonna get him back anyway. Yeah, exactly. It's... It's not like I needed them to get to this point. I was gonna be fine either way. Yeah, no, no luck. Big sad. Oh, you've got to be shitting me. Uh, I say we do it. Yeah, I know we're doing that. Use it on the way up after I get the rest of the items. Good call. Very good call. I just need to be careful here. Continue the run as normal. 
No, but then... Use right before the beast fight. Yeah, okay. Um, let's find the skull first. I'm gonna consume the poop then. So then I have the poop trinket as part of my character. It's a pretty good one to have, in all honesty. Wait, have I missed it? Hang on. I'm gonna consume the poop. Yeah, I mean, it's one of the strange sentences you will say in this game. There's a trinket, which is a dried out piece of poop, and what it does is when you destroy poop, it gives you a chance of getting an item. Or a better chance, I should say. That chance is always there, it's just with the trinket, it's... Pretty much every time it's gonna happen. So... Yeah, all right. I got it now, so we're, we're good. This is this is a really tough choice because I could do the alternate path as well, but I think uh, let's take it. It's fine. The fool. The R key sets me up for so much. I'm kind of torn, like if I should go base or if I should go alternate path. I guess it depends which one I believe is harder. Do I have delirium? Uh, yes, I do. But see, Hush isn't that big a- like... I don't struggle doing Hush, whereas in these two I, I kind of do. That's the thing. I don't really struggle with Delirium either. Alright, the alternate path pretty much if I get any form of damage reduction, it's a done it's done. I'm not really sure which one's worth the investment here. I don't struggle with the RNG boss. Yeah, not really.
I don't really struggle with the bullet hell boss either if I have padding. Yeah, I don't know. I'm a little torn here. I've never had delir I've never had delirium teleport onto me. Okay, hold on. Thank you. I think I'll, I'll just I'll just do the base. Fuck it. What if I would have. Okay. What if I was to try and bait it and then hit the R key at the last second? Like, would that. Like, let's say I bait the base and then I press the R key. What would happen? Is that possible? I would have to be pretty quick at the finger. Like, as it, as it dies, there's an animation that plays. The question is if I get the completion mark right away or not. Like, if I'm feeling that ballsy. Yeah, it depends on when it gives you the mark. But then it, I still achieve my goal, right? Like, my goal is to do the beast. It's like, either, either way I, I achieve what I want to achieve. I don't know what a quality does, but sure. Chili pepper! With five luck? Hell yeah. Oh right, I'm supposed to go up, not down. <laughs> Autopilot. I can use the R key and get a completely broken run. Yeah, but like, is it? Is it really that much better? All right, we we on full health now. Oh, okay. Bibble. I did it just to grab a book. You need to repent. You need to confess your sins and become saved. Let his light inside you cleanse your you soul. Insane. You are terrible. 
taking this too far. Do you hear about the sound? Pray for you. That's a lot of fire. Oh, I got... Alright. I guess we're done with that. I mean, everything's pretty good. I think from a combat position, I'm doing really well. Go for the temporary damage up. I'm getting more damage of every hit. Am I? Uh. It's going down. Well, okay. It seems to be on every kill. Which I guess it's gonna slow down eventually, right? Limited power, maybe. Well, it's gone now, it's going down. So I better hurry. What the fuck? It does nothing. There's nothing here. So, hey, Mentor. Okay, this was very quick takedown. Very quick.
Ja, okay. They seem to have quite the firewall here. Oh no, it damages. What? Get the fuck out. Wow, get fu get fucking wrecked. What about the big la the laser thing? Now use the R key. Hang on, hang on. I want to see when the mark comes through. I think it's after a death animation. Then Damn it! <laughs> All right, whatever. It's fine. Reached down into the earth, smiting the mother of harlots asunder and setting the blood lake to a boil. I thought maybe I could reset it. That's cool. Yeah, 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 yeah. I was successful in what I was trying to do, so I'm happy. So most of these are... Yeah, doing well. Uh... I don't... Okay. Let's take a look at this for a sec. I guess Maggie... Eve... Samson... I haven't done that on Samson, really? All right. I'm leaving the tainted characters until I'm done with the base characters. That's how I'm treating it. You don't want to bring back PTSD, but is it possible to have too much healing as Void Fiend? I mean, ideally you shouldn't have healing, because it messes with your transform. That being said, you don't necessarily have to stick to uh, a build where uh, you transform. You can do perfectly well without transforming. It's just very situational.
Okay, guess that's that. Oh, sick. Just redo this floor again. Oh, this is super handy. Okay, let's start the process of skipping now. Uh, I guess I don't have enough damage to self-sustain yet, but... I just restarted this floor. I'll start it from the next floor, not this one. Since this one's still technically a freebie. Interesting. It's not bad. It is nice that I can scan the map and see if I've got in the planetarium. Oh. No, well, th this is just clear. Oh, shit. <laughs> I forgot about the massive explosion, idiots. I completely forgot about it. It is my bad. Oh no. Okay. I mean, I may as well do that for the bonus damage. Okay, good. Yeah, so I can see right away if I've gotten it or not. Okay, let's play towards Samson's strength here. That'll do. That will do. Oh, 
What an annoying room. There we go. It was worth a shot. I think I missed. Really? I don't know. I thought it was. Look at. Oh, damn it! Oh, that erratic movement. I mean, I can still get it. Oh, yeah, it was off. Alright, anyway. Not that it was worth it, but since I have a surplus of keys... Pheromones. And I'm not really going to be using them right away. I feel like they've been. Oh, <laughs> I feel like they've improved this quite a bit. Get this over and done with. Uh, that was great. I was gonna say, I feel like they buffed uh, how often those bums give out stuff. Because I remember it, it was never worth doing, but that, uh, yeah, that really, really was good. Uh, pill mimic. Okay. Uh, mm. ah, okay. Isn't that caffeine pill? I don't know. Maybe. It doesn't matter. I might get it anyway. We'll see. We're still not done with this yet. I do want to stick to the box of friends, but it would be quite the thing to take that. I'm kind of torn. Box of friends is really nice to have, but yeah, I don't know. We'll see. Okay, bear with me. Mm. 
Uh, I don't want to be touching that, right? It's okay, trust in the system. Um, that's Empress. that. Get rid of red hearts first. There's two ways I, I, I potentially play this. Is hang on. Do planetarium items stack if you get two of them? Not sure, hmm. Interesting. Okay. The secret room one isn't going to do much when having two of them. No, I know. That one, I can understand it's not going to do much. It's more on the other one. I think this just single-handedly saved it. I need to take one more hit to get whatever the next thing is, which will either be health, an item... A teleport or money. I'm hoping it's the item. Anyway, I got the health to be able to survive the hit, so. Let's. Order of operations here. First, go into the curse room. Which, nope, we're just leaving that immediately. Okay, and now let's just hope. Money. Okay, well. I have a choice to make here. I can either take it with me and gamble. And just be like, alright, who cares. Or I use it in this treasure room here. I think let's just buy it and let's just see where this goes. Uh, yeah, I mean, time saver, I guess. Alright. Let's go. I'm gonna take the gamble. No planetarium, okay. Oh, what an annoying room. They're kind of all hanging out at the edge.
Jeez, dude. <laughs> How irritating. Yeah, so now I just gotta hope that I get damage items here. Golden bomb, alright, that'll work. This is my source of damage for this floor. Yeah, I know, I know. Risky, risky. I can open that with iframes. Open what with iframes? The Mimic and the Curse Room. Oh. Yeah, eh, it's fine. Butter. Hmm. Um, let's grab this. It's nice to see how much health things have. Butter with this active item. Uh, I don't know. I guess it's worth a shot. I don't think it works, but we can try. Maybe look it up. That would be ridiculous, insanely overpowered if that was the case. I doubt it works. Yeah, I was about to say, like, Mr. McMuffin and his No Fun Allowed. With this, uh, DLC. And the balance changes. I would imagine not allowed. Yeah, thought so, okay. Um, then I'm gonna go get my other one back. It's useful for putting down an item in the reroll room. But aside from that, not really a whole lot else. You should have seen the build I got yesterday. It was pretty funny. With the pill baby and the vert pill, I just kept spitting it up and it just kept doing damage. So it was like a free Necronomicon. It was a pretty funny build. 
Uh... This has diminishing returns, right? Pretty sure it does. But getting a second one isn't that better. Let's just keep going. I know that getting two of the same item is not the best idea. No planetarium still, big sad. I'm hoping for a massive payoff here. Nice. <laughs> that eases up the uh, tension a little. Oh. I mean, it would be nice to know what items I guess I'm passing on. But then again, does it matter? I probably should have yared that. Ugh, it's fine. Oh, fuck. I'm an idiot. I went and got lard. I don't know why I just did that. Ah, uh, okay. I may as well just grab it then. I know it's going to make me slow. I sort of autopiloted there a little bit. So, do you have to do it in a row, or is it just in general? I mean, I suppose it could still happen. I gotta go drop that trinket off in the other room.
Ow. That hurt. I didn't think the explosion would still go off in the cross. Ugh, pill bag. Friends till the end. Pew. Okay, that's fine. Uh, you know what? I think it's probably easier if I do this. Drop it here and then come back. There we go. There we go. Alright. Yeah, still nothing. Yera. Nice, got it. A nice freebie. Okay, uh Concern is still here, but I think I'll I'll be fine. <laughs> Well, oh, no, okay, it's fine. Get wrecked. <laughs> Uh, pill baggy. Yeah. Okay. Why not? Okay, let's see. Uh, 
uh, not really worth duplicating. I'm not having much luck with this. Alright, go. Nah, nah. Didn't happen for this either. Shed and wait, a cool short anime does made for Warframe's 50th. Okay, I'll take a look later. Nice, I guess. All right. Yeah, I mean, I've seen the telescopic lens or whatever. Okay. Good shit. Unfortunately, I don't really know how much health I have, but... I can sort of deduce it. That's two hearts. Three hearts. Just take it. It's okay. It's again, diminishing returns. And I'm I'm full of red hearts anyway. So if it doesn't happen on the next floor, I'll take the item room pretty much. This always happens, like every time I hold out for a reward with this. It just doesn't pan out to be anything great. Just to speed shit along. I mean, whatever, I got nothing to lose in trying. I seem to have more success when I'm not trying. Like, just letting it happen. Kimpy! Alright, cool. I mean, I've got a pretty good build. I'd say it's pretty well equipped for fighting. Oh no, I forgot to get the card. Fuck. There's no way back then. I forgot about the stupid fucking card I autopiloted. Um, can I do it? I can't do anything with this then. Oh no, wait. Polaroid. Yeah, let's just do a Polaroid run. Fine. I'll do a Polaroid run. I, I can do that much. 
That'll be easy. This build is already capable of winning that. You never know, maybe I'll get an Arky as well. <laughs> and hang on to uh, this until the Polaroid or the chest. It's valid. I don't know why I went that way. That's, uh... Ooh. I'm gonna do that, just for good measure. So then there's at least one heart that doesn't, uh... result in a loss. Kill you, matter. It's still doing pretty well, given how many items I skipped. Try and do this as quick as I can. <laughs> That's a lot of hearts there. I should I should do this just to increase my damage. It's worth it, uh I know that there's a, what do you call it, sacrifice room or whatever there, but it's too far away, can't be bothered. Eh. Okay, this is just going to make the fight easier and getting... I mean, the R key is only found in the secret room, right? So, that's the only chance I have of getting one. And the shop, but I can't run into a shop anymore.
<laughs> nah, I'm good. Although I suppose that, uh, I suppose at the end of this I should, huh? didn't allow me to ascend, huh? Okay. Back to full health. I think it's this... No, it's not this way. I was trying to go the correct way. There's still a chance for a donation bin, so... Can't rule it out. Oh, that's annoying. Wow, that's annoying. Guppy! Alright, cool. Full lock, that's pretty good. Now that lock actually matters for this. I've been holding on to this for the entire run. There we go. I hate how they've changed this to not swap to the new one. It 
it's either one or the other drops, so it's a little lame. I'm just marching to the end as quick as I can. I would like another attempt at this. Oh, no. I was quite fortunate. <laughs> yeah, leap into the blood. Finish this up. Yeah, no, we're good. <laughs> okay, give me a sec. I'm just gonna get a drink out of the fridge. And we'll continue. I'll let this play out whilst I do that. Hey, I mean, progress is progress. I had to do that at some point. Uh, cool. So it just leaves the alternate path. Alright, let's try and do it this time. <laughs> Hopefully with more planetarium this time. That would be nice. Not that getting a planetarium guarantees a win, right? I will get the first item. 
Uh, huh. Isn't this OP with something like Meat Boy? From what I've heard is you can just sit still. As long as you don't attack. Anything that auto attacks, it can be a pretty good combo. Not the best starting item, though, I will say. That's a damage up. Sure. I'm debating whether or not I should <laughs> grab items. The planetarium stuff is is a huge long shot. money at the moment, not a whole lot of point. for the trinket. <laughs> Now that I've taken damage. Oh, well, that's nice. Guess I better go to the store then. Yeah, it wasn't worth it. So wait, if I pour... <sighs> Look, how does this... It 
just stress testing something here. Yeah, it doesn't really work. Okay. <laughs> I was hoping maybe it would have a, a different hitbox. Make cube would be ridiculous with this. Okay, I got damage up, so that's nice. Um, hold on. Challenge room. We can do challenge room. Gal galaxy brain gameplay. Do you want to talk about smart? <laughs> Come on, that was impressive. I just thought about something. Could it, couldn't I win this way? As long as I keep going up and down. Crossing paths, it would work. Okay, there is there is a little nuance to it. Like, if I pause spawn, it would work. Right, where is it spawning? I needed to get it whilst it was on the ground, but I'll keep that in mind. Okay. 
I have to go look for the planetarium, assuming there is one. Bad luck. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I guess anything that can auto attack would uh, cause the win. Oh, why'd I do that for? Nah, it doesn't matter. Ooh, this is uh, a little sketchy in terms of health. enough keys. Hey, got it. Whoa. Yeah, I don't know if I like this one. So weird. Of all the ones I could have gotten. This one's a more distracting one. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. Not the best planetarium item. Okay, that's a good one. Health up puberty. Let me do this. Finally, had been any other one except that.
I find that charge more distracting than useful. <laughs> it says double tap, but sometimes I feel like I don't double tap it and it still goes off. Onwards. Oh, uh, give me a sec. I need to remedy this real quick. Which cable is it? I think it's this one. It made the noise, so... Apparently your cat likes gingerbread cookies. <laughs> Interesting. What makes you say it like, like, really likes it? Oh, cool. Nice. Just what I needed. She's eating them and she's usually super picky. Right. Makes sense. Okay, money shot. <laughs> Plus restocking shops. All right, let's. I changed my mind very quickly. I was like, there's still chests and stuff, so. I was gonna say I might be able to get it without resorting to taking out a loan, but. Okay, this will work. One, two, three, four. Okay, stop. This is really good. This is a good item for uh, Samson. Because it's just a portable way to generate damage at the start of the floor. I know this has been nerfed, but it still has its uses. And since we have money shot as well. Oh, okay.
then this is good. Hey, I said her intellect, what's up? Hey! That was close. Uh, I guess. I did take out health, so... We shall see. At the very least, I can now pick when I get my damage, so that's nice. Thank you. Okay, what are we gonna get? Two clubs, death, stars, temperance. Uh huh. Um, take this. Ah, it's a curse of the blind. All right. That's a little annoying. <laughs> nice. I suppose I should do that. I'll use it if I don't get the angel room this floor. Hey Nick, so when you wanted me to drop the trinket again, what was it supposed to do originally? Because it obviously did nothing, so... What was... what were you expecting it to do? Okay, that's lucky. Uh, no idea what this could be. Alright. Just do that. Pretty happy with this build already. Ladder options and stop. Oh, the butter. Uh, it's not really going to be much use, is it? I could consume it for stats, but I think it's it's good to have it like this. Oh yeah, right, it's more options. I get the pick. Oh, 
Uh, I will probably consume this for stats. Really? Okay. Oh. I could consume the key for stats as well. Like, Hmm, tough choice. No, I think I won't consume the key for stats. Okay. Use it here. Damn. Oh well. It actually would have been good to consume because I would have gotten two consumptions. This isn't bad, this is a good item. can damage boost myself when I get to the next floor. That's shame, range and <laughs> shot speed up. But whatever, I'll take it. Yeah, this is a good synergy. Because I can buff Samson right at the start of the floor. Love the bag for a speed up. <laughs> Pretty lucky. Okay, I'll buy it. Oh, right, I can carry too. Nice. close. Nice. Come on. This is good because I have restocking shops anyway, so... If I'm earning more money... It's a good thing. Thank fuck. <laughs> I didn't want that, to be honest.
Damn. Oh well. I'll come back to it, just not right now. Range down. Oh, I'm surprised. I thought it would have been there. Uh, PhD. Alright, cool. I can see forever. And something that generates pills. Range up. I mean, <laughs> I think that was the good choice there. Take advantage of the fact that it was a cheap one. Storing battery charges isn't bad either. It's just the bag at the moment's really good. Wow, how have you not broken? I'm gonna go get a couple more positive pills. Oh, I can do this. I, no, no, this is better. Uh, yep, okay, hang on. <laughs> Surely this gives me it. since I was going to say we have a surplus of health, but it did not work out for me. We've got a, a lot of uh, keys here. Okay. Oh, it's not being fair like before. Dude, how many keys have I just fed you? Uh, that's a pretty good trinket. Okay. 
Hold on, I have a hangman card here. Good. I'm gonna take it, because it'll let me damage boost. Okay. I guess. <laughs> Shit. One, two, three, four, five, six. Pretty sure. Pretty positive. Mm. Why do I keep getting the spider room? every time. health. Uh, what is this? This is one. Okay. Yes, go, Bugo, go. Uh, I guess. It's no big deal if I health down. I did get uh, a damage down there, which, ugh. Okay, there it is, planetarium. Did I just get Mars again, really? Oh my god. That's just unlucky. This used to be a game break, but now it's not. It's a little sad.
I couldn't get the treasure room anyway. <laughs> I'm out of keys. It's pretty funny. I don't know, this is more distracting than anything else. Okay, got it. I'm not even double tapping, it's just doing it. <laughs> Better chests, I guess. Eh, the card thing. Okay, I gotta look for the skull. Yara. Yes, just do that. <laughs> this charge is really distracting. Stop it! Okay, no angel room, I guess. Keep going. Alright, let me just go collect one thing real quick.
Ah, there was a tinted rock there, shit. Okay, I guess we're done. Not even double tapping. <laughs> there I did, but there's so many times where I don't, and it just is like, nah. You're gonna do a charge attack. Oh shit, I forgot to drop a trinket. I think I can still do it here, so we're okay. Suppose I'll drop the... the key one. Okay. that at the end. It's too easy to double tap with the D-pad, that's my complaint about this item. A sack. Stop it! Oh my god, this item's so annoying.
Na dobrze. I shit wrong. Ugh. Wrong thing. Alright. Oh, what's that? I can't hear you over the sound of it working. I don't want to say anything, but I was pretty certain it did work. I'll piss off. Now we just gotta hope all those items I left behind are going to serve some... some good. Sure. All right, it's not this one. Let me move forward first, and then I'll come back for it. Okay. <laughs> Metroid rockets. I mean, go for it anyway. Yep. I really didn't miss out on much. Whoa. 
What is that? Everything, Jar. Anything is possible. Nah. Stick to me, Thick. So we do have Perthro here. Excellent. Good, 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 good. I mean, I picked it up so it registers. I'm guessing it's like the heart jar, but you can put everything in it if you want. I don't know. Or it's an item that pops up a bunch of items. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm not patient enough for this. Back. Dude. There we go. You need to repent. You need to confess your sins and become saved. Let his light inside you cleanse your you soul. Be insane. You are taking this too far. Yeah, wow. This was not a great run. It's still pretty average. The items I left behind really were not that good. Sure. I don't know. I don't like the Mars item. I think it's very detrimental. At least that's not bad. Okay, let me use the death card just to get through a room. It's just so easy to double tap it when you're using the D-pad. When you're doing like quick dodges and precise dodges, it's just, it's fucked. I hate it. I'm probably not gonna pick up this item ever again, to be honest. It's not my style. It's not only D-pad, it triggers on a joystick as well, everyone hates it. Yeah. I mean, I think it's... In the spirit of it, it's a cool idea, it's just, it's very clunky. I'm not quite sure how you could alleviate it. You could probably redesign it as an on-use item that, like, has a cooldown, and it's not one that's multi-use, it's kind of one that you can just... Basically the same thing, it's just a use item, and that would be better. Because then you can control when it happens a lot easier, and it doesn't affect your dodging.
I can't believe I got it two times in a row, though. That's... That's a little annoying. Not a whole lot I could do about it. Oh shit, I fucked up. Oh well. Oh, here, here we go. Sweet! Two tier up items, let's go. Gotta remember to leave one key. Oh! It's the big key now. <laughs> yeah, I mean... I don't need it. I'm keeping me six. Fuck this room. Fuck that room. I'm not going anywhere near it. I'm gonna heal anyway. Damn it. Um, yeah, it's not gonna help. Okay, well, at the very least, I got the unlock. Oh, you look weird. <laughs> That's cool. It's like Caveman Samson. Okay. You know, in hindsight, I probably should have kept the Ace of Hearts. Oh no, but I couldn't. There's no real way for me to keep it. Nice, the projectiles slow down. Alright, good shit. Yep. Caused me to dash into the fire. What a what a great item.
Wait, it doesn't work? Oh, it probably got to fly. Fuck off! Oh my god, that charge is so annoying. Okay, there we go. Yeah, I'm never picking up Mars again. It's so counterproductive, it's not funny. Jesus Christ. What is going on? Why is it so weird? Flames were all strange. Alright. We're good. I thought Mars was gonna screw me over. Alright, that's Samson complete. Yeah, 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 we've heard it before. Yeah, he's he's complete. Um all right, I haven't done a Zazzle, so let's do a Zazzle. Oh, that looks really weird. That'll complete a Zazzle as well, so... Is this pretty much just gonna be... Do I get full brimstone? If I don't, I'm fucked. I mean, I went for the early gamble. I can hurt my, my way out, so we're okay. The hermit. Not a bad idea to try and get that. The hive mind already. Been before like three runs in a row where I get that Mars item. Uh. 
Does it count the first floor? Like, if I... What's the... What is the condition? Like, as long as I don't go in the room? Or is it as long as I don't unlock the door? Because the door's already unlocked. Wait, what's this? Oh. It counts? Alright. Well, yeah, I mean... Azazel's one of the least early game item dependent characters. So I can do pretty well without picking up anything. It's just later it, it does become uh, pretty bad. Also, fantastic. We're completing the Meat Boy. That's, uh, super good. Now I have a way to generate health, so... Oh, wow, already. Okay, better. <laughs> Look where the size of uh, the minions. I'm still gonna keep doing it. Because I would imagine it stacks, alright? Well, I mean, let's say the chance got reset now. It's still good, because I would keep going. We'll see. Oh, come on, dude. Don't be like that. Yeah, so it'll be reset, and cannot be increased further. Oh. So then, I should start picking up items now then, because it can't go back up. The lovers. I guess that's fair. Whoops. Wow, this thing sucks. All right, I'm going. I'm gonna gamble it. I'm like, there's no way it's that far away. There we go. All right, I guess we're picking up items now then.
What is that? Balance scale, money and health? Blood money. Pound the flesh. Alright, I mean, look, I'm... I was, whoa. Oh. That's... interesting. Wait, so if I... Huh. Okay. Yeah, I don't know about that choice. And devil deals cost money or something. Interesting. Um, uh, I would like a bomb, but... I don't know if it'll give me a... Okay. Ace. Wow. Yep, worth it. Alright. Maybe buy a key? Nah. I think it's fine. Because I'm doing the ascent, even if I miss it, I'll just get it on the way back up. It's not that urgent. And I would much rather hang on to the health, because devil deals. We're good. Uh, I'm gonna do it because it will just save me bombs. Plus we can find, um, what do you call it, crawl spaces and whatnot. Movement speed for the time being. Uh, this one I actually have to blow up. <laughs> Worth it. Let's just do that because I get an item for it. Sometimes. <laughs> I had a hunch. Okay. 
Oh, no devil deal? Okay, well. Keep going. Ah, oh, no! It costs 30, fuck. Okay, I need to save 30 gold quickly. I'm not sure I'll be able to swing that, but we'll see. And then I have to get the devil deal again. Ugh. No, it's, it's an item that's causing it. Which, okay, I'm a little more relieved now. I think I'll be good. Yeah, okay, we're good now. Yeah, it's called blood money. I'm gonna be sad if I don't get it, though. Um, I gotta go to the shop and try and... Well, kill a keeper so then the odds increase again. Me six. Okay. Take it. I know, I know, I know. I'm being careful. Okay. I'm not overspending. I'm gonna take me six with me and see if I can get it to steal it. Wait, why is it minus 8%? Ah, uh, uh, alright. I think I'd, I'd much rather have the higher percent and guarantee it. The book has a higher likelihood of devil deals. And so, 1 in 4 chance that I don't get it. Ugh. Come on! Yes, thank fuck. Okay, we good, chat. We good. There we go. Less to worry about. Azazel is powered up now. I'm gonna go for full clears just to get more money. Um, let's see what else we can get out of this. Compass? Alright. Try and steal a compass. It's fine, just take it. Yeah, 
It's an interesting item. I wouldn't recommend that too much. Thank you. Let's just do that, just to do a full reveal of the map. It's unlikely that I get another devil item, as it's going to cost me 30. Okay, that's, that's not bad. Well, the big two, the big ticket ones are going to cost me 30. That's what I mean. The ones that probably matter. Okay, I'll... We'll go and impale myself a couple times, see if I get anything. There is a 30, but I don't know what it is. Not that I can afford it. Kind of a shame. That does nothing, right? Oh. Oh no. Uh, I don't know. I think I like that. It's still longer, I guess. Wait, does that affect devil rooms? It should, right?
That's uh, that's a little annoying. But okay. I'm gonna try and force myself in there again. Nice. Uh, take the 15. No! Oh, no, it's fine. Seven. Pentagram. Alright. That worked. I'm content with that. Yeah, I don't know. I don't like this. what it's done to my f tears, but whatever. It is what it is. Can't really do much about it. Wow, what a dick. Yep, game is a dickhead. I was trying to generate as much money as I could, but probably won't work out. Bible. Uh. I mean, suppose it's useful to one-shot her. And I do get bookworm out of it. It's not like that health is that important to me. Oh, cool. Uh, but no, not yet. Uh-huh. Um, I will probably stick with the book, though. I do need to leave a trinket behind. Shame I couldn't get the hairball, but whatever. It is what it is. Um, okay. The fool. Oh, there's a rock there. I see it. Yeah, let's just go. Okay. Nice. 
nice. Here we go. Yeah, I don't care about the shroom one. In fact, the black rune would be nice so I can absorb it. I mean, has its uses. It's nice to not take damage every now and then. Yeah. Okay, keep going. Three potential heals throughout the fight. Got, got the items. <laughs> Not that it mattered, still here. Did I get- oh, I got the treasure here, didn't I? Yeah, okay. Should be able to get all my health back by the time I get up there. <laughs> no trapdoor, that's sad. You know what? Sure. I have some red health. Is this one of the ones? No. 
Yeah, I'll check just in case. speed up. Held on to that health as long as I could. <laughs> oh shit. Next run, get something good. Alright, cool. There aren't that many, uh, elites here. It's been pretty straightforward so far. Okay, there we go. Oh, well, I mean, I may as well go unlock it and bring it back. Okay. And the Zazzle without flight? Is that what I'm seeing? Anyway. Okay, let's do it. Okay. 
Did I really just get hit by a holy shot? Ugh. Thank fuck for me, boy. That's all I gotta say. Got him pretty lucky. That was pretty lucky. Didn't do much of the bullet health shit. Alright, let's go. I mean, even with the smaller hitboxes, this isn't easy. Oh no, Mate Boy's useless here. He's just swimming in lava. He's not doing anything. He can't fly. That's, uh, that's a little sad. Yeah, this eyeball thing's kind of fucked me. I've lost my full range. Like, it's really hindered my motion. If I lose, it'll be because of- straight up because of this. sake. Where's Battery Baby offering the free charges? Right. Yeah, it's not looking good. In a, isn't it room clear? I don't think so, like... It won't offer batteries, but it'll offer, like, little ticks of charges as you're fighting sometimes. Like, see, look look right now, I'm on an odd number. I shouldn't be on an odd number. It's given me a tick. Can me, boy, can you do something now, or are you still... No, he's just running. about that part.
Yeah, actually, the dead cat is, uh... It's pretty fucking good in this regard. You can't. I, I should still be able to have it. The eyeball thing definitely hindered me a lot, but it didn't completely mess me up, thankfully. Dead cat MVP. <laughs> it saved the run. All right, sweet. Then suddenly, the sky above cracked open, and a white beam of light reached down into the earth. Yeah. The mother of harlots asunder. And cool. That's uh, yeah, he's completed now, right? I'm pretty sure. Yep, completed. So Samson completed. Isaac completed. Judas is just missing the alternate path, which... That's an ordeal in itself. Um, Alright, sin since I did get Eden's blessing, let me do an Eden run. Where's Eden? There you are. And Eden just needs to... Yeah, just regular stuff, it's fine. Cool. Alright, let's just roll with it. Purity? And... Oh, okay. This is, uh, this is a start. What the fuck? <laughs> yeah, okay. One percent on the first floor, that's uh that's solid. Shit, I should have tested it nah, but it it's funny, I get it, and it's that one, so it's like, duplicating it wouldn't have done shit. Wait, where's the other one? Oh, no, I've already been in there. Okay. <laughs> Mental start. Oh, it's revealed? What? Why did it get revealed? 
Oh no, but the thing, yeah, I see. One of them gets revealed, not both. Trying not to get hit because I got purity with damage. It's going to happen, obviously, eventually, but for now. Not a great one to get, but whatever. Oh, eh, nah. nearly hit me. Taking a guess. It's not there. Taking a guess. It's not there. Okay, taking the guess. There we go. Unfortunately, I didn't get another bomb. Yeah, and there's no other bomb in here. <laughs> Shit. Okay. Yeah. Well, I answer with this then. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> nice. Can't complain about that. I was hoping for a bomb. Oh well. Let's leave. I gotta remember, I gotta make try and make a... Uh... Wait, do I? Hang on. No, I've already done hush. Okay, then no, no timing to make. The lovers. Just hitting myself with some 
extra damage. Makes AS6 cheap. Which I guess we can use to open you up first. No devil deal. Um, well, I can still get this. <laughs> there we go. Anything else? Nah, let's just... I think I can still get something from me six just a sec. Aw, uh, nah. Okay. I'll still recharge it, I guess. I'll go see if there's a challenge room or something. Uh, 
maybe. Yeah, okay. That was right. That's the one downside to the lunar item, is you do need bombs to back it up. <laughs> oh, what is- oh, the fire rate is so bad right now. I guess because all my stacks are gone. Wait, why is... <sighs> yeah, okay, damage is really low. But I guess because quad shot. Ugh, movement speed again. Ugh. Give stats, please. Okay. Okay, it's on, uh, damage now. tried. But at least now I have damage, because, uh, yeah. I was really lacking. That's not what I wanted. Why would you do that? Telepathy? It's not going well. Okay. 
course, no shop. Okay, well, at least there's that. Not that it matters too much, but that's something. Okay. If this was anything other than a standard finish, I'd be worried. This dice room. Open that up for me. It's a pedestal reroll. Okay. Let me see what's in the shop first. Hey Sandy, how's it going? Man, I, I need something to change, otherwise I probably won't make it. <laughs> oh, come on! Alright, there's a guaranteed shop on the next one, right? Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna try and re-roll. I guess. I got enough money. Okay, the thing I gotta keep in mind here is, regardless, it'll still let me, uh, keep the room open. Okay. 
Okay, taking that. What is in here? Box. Uh. Try and steal this one. Of course not. Uh, there's no more. How am I doing? All right, just kicking back as usual. Hmm. I wonder if there's enough to get a recharge here. Nah. <laughs> Okay, uh, I don't think I left a battery anywhere. Hmm. Alright, fuck it. <sighs> Just... No, wait, 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 wait. I can get it, I can get it. I can get it, I can get it, I can get it. Through here. And then hopefully I can steal it, and then I'll re-roll it. Depends if the game's a dick. Let's see. I need something of an advantage, or uh, it's not gonna end up as a win. <laughs> I nearly got pulled into that. Okay, let's try again. Okay, got it this time. If nothing else, I got that transformation, so... Now, fingers crossed. That's unfortunate. What else? And I guess we'll see what's in the devil room. Come on, that has to be something good. Wait, it didn't reroll. Oh, it doesn't affect it. Okay. Oh, well. I still got something out of it. I thought it didn't affect the deals themselves, but it would still affect the items, but I guess that's why it's just too good if it does. Uh, sure, why not? Yeah, I don't know. Confidence is still not high on this one. Uh. 
I'll get that at the end. I thought the start of it was amazing, like the, all the stuff I got, but then it's come to a grinding halt. Okay, well this has to be a shop here. Uh, wow, fuck you. Okay, that's placebo. I may as well buy that. Alright, let's see how much I can donate. Alright, decent. <laughs> Good enough, I guess. Okay, it just <laughs> opened the secret door for me, thanks. Okay, that's not bad. At least it's something to go with the luck stat I have. Okay. Oh, there's another one back there. I should go get it quickly. Oh, I have to... No, wait, no, I don't. No, I don't. Fuck you. There we go. I don't think I'll be able to steal an item now. Uh, let's see if this gives me anything. Come on. Nah. Uh, guess I got the pick, right? Just do this one.
Okay, I feel a bit better now. It's not as dire as before. Ah, the blood. Shit. Probably here. Uh... I don't really want to use the level skip. Stop it. Excuse me. Thank you. Didn't see it. Uh, what is it? It's okay. Reroll items on ground. Full health. Ah, oh, come on. Okay, don't be stingy. Okay, well, at least that's just gonna save time. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Oh, it's, is it this one here? Yeah, it's this one here. There we go. the horseman. So it's not going to be a usable item. <laughs> eh. Keep it moving. Sure. Stop it! Just let me damage it.
stuff that was annoying. Greed's Gullet, that's not bad. It's one of the rarer items too. Get that for me, will ya? In a sec. One, two. But yeah, I gotta remember I have infinite bombs. There's no sense in completing the room. No, why? Why didn't you follow the marker? Alright, whatever. Uh, uh, up we go. Oh, I could have, well. No. I don't think my bombs are anything special right now, so... No, thank you.
Probably should have left that, but eh, it's fine. That's why. Pretty fly. Hold up. Give me the bombs. Thank you. What? Okay. I thought for sure that was it. Still a couple. Really? Thanks, dickhead. <laughs> Alright, whatever. I suppose it lets me open golden ones for free, so... Oh, it wasn't there. Nope. Okay, I tried. Guess. <laughs> it does make it more interesting. This looks really cool. Yeah, maybe. I still have 17 keys, so... Oh yeah, right, this is a range up now. Bozo! Yeah, 
Yeah, this is a little obnoxious. I wish I could move it around quicker. Oh right, it would have opened that, wouldn't it? Don't you dare move. Oh shit, uh, you can open it. Pretty sure. There you go. So how does- oh, I see. I shoot something every now and then. <laughs> oh, it cancels control tier. I mean, I'm kind of glad to be honest. This looks cooler. <laughs> okay. Well, not what I wanted. Okay. Uh, you know what? I may as well. I need to do delirium, so let's do Mega Satan in the hope of getting it.
All right, I tried to find the other one, couldn't find it. Wait, where is it? All right, that's the starting room. There we go. I mean, this is a good fighting build for it. I think if I just keep shooting, I should be okay, because my shield should block it. Good shit. And excellent, it happened. Alright, let's finish this. Don't mind you, this is not a good delirium fighting build, but I'll try. I don't really want to fight right now. Thanks, friend, <laughs> for saving me the hassle. Okay, I have an exit strategy, so I can go do the other stuff. Ah, it's not really going to help in the slightest, so leave it. <laughs> Alright! <laughs> now I know where it is. Now let's go do everything else. Yeah. <laughs> 
Come on, we can have more interesting items than that. Dude, <laughs> items, not health. Jeez. I'm worried about this. Yeah, that's pretty much just plus five bombs. I already have toxic bombs. Nothing of value. Wow. Yay, 99. Grade Scarlet, full effect. Okay, well, that's something. High luck. Yeah, that at least is something. Alright, I guess we're good. That's everything I can do. Go, me six, go. All right.
Yeah, this is a little hard to shoot and hit now. Wait, did Misik stop? I don't think Misik can keep up. Or it stopped. One or the other. Maybe it only detected a particular form as the enemy and not... I have no clue. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Good stuff. Bozo the Clown MVP. Oh, it's going after the wrong thing. It's too hard to aim for it. Alright, I got this. Okay, that just leaves uh, the negative path and then, yeah. Eden done. <laughs> right? I'm pretty sure. Let's have a look. Yeah, so it's just uh, the negative. Alright. That's enough. I'm done with Isaac. Uh, jeez, it's already past midnight. I was gonna do some, um... Monument Valley, but I think I'm just gonna leave it here. It's past midnight. <laughs> I don't want to be starting something new. Anyway, thanks uh, for hanging out and watching me do some Isaac runs. A lot of progress, I think, in terms of character unlocks and marks, so yeah, good stuff. <laughs>